Okay, so please welcome the European Film Club. So thank Hi, you all for being here. Hi. Um, can you tell us a bit about your work and about your experience at the European Film Club? So, my name is Hannah again, and uh, basically I'm part of the European Film Club for almost two years now, and I think it's a really an amazing experience, and I'm very happy to be part of it. Uh, what for all of us, uh, not just us, but all the other participants, it is important to spread a strong message, and it is important to uh, influence young people to start watching uh, European movies because they usually have a really powerful and good message and uh, that is really important to us. It is also uh, better because we want to be uh, seen and heard, uh, especially the youth, so yes, that is, in my opinion, like in a nutshell what we do. And now, uh, do anyone of you want to speak? Hi, I'm Maria, I'm from Portugal. And I think European Film Club gave us the opportunity to share opinions with, and perspectives from young people from all over Europe. And it was so good feeling that we matter and we can build a, a strong group because together we are stronger. And each two months we have a meeting where we share ideas and we share solutions for the film industry and for us to stand out. Can you maybe um, tell us about um, how you usually meet or how, you, how often do you meet and um, how does this meeting went? How um, do they go? Hello, my name is Madura. I'm from Latvia. I mean, yeah, we have meetings like in online in Zoom in once um, uh, two months. Yeah, and we are discussing a lot of things in these meetings, yeah. Uh, also, uh, so we don't only meet on Zoom meetings. Right now, for example, we are together in Lubeck, and uh, there are other European Film Academy uh, members who are meeting uh, all over Europe in cities, and we are all attending uh, different festivals. So that is another way to meet. And okay. it, I find it really amazing. What about you, Jonas? Yeah. Uh, so, hi, I'm Jonas, uh, I'm from Lithuania, uh, I'm part of the Youth Council, and uh, the Youth Council uh, usually meets uh, like once a month, uh, so, and we actually, uh, moreover, talk about, uh, uh, we have a strong connection with the adults uh, who are, uh, you know, generating ideas and giving us to them to, uh, ask opinions about it uh, in the European Film Club and uh, we sort of kind of built what we have now the European Film Club was built upon the Youth Council as it is and I believe it might even grow out to something pretty big in the future. How long have you been um, with the uh, uh, I've the been uh, for about three years now with the Youth Council and the European Film Club. Okay, and you, Liva? Hi, my name is Liva, I'm from Latvia also, and for me I have been a part of a consultation group for, I think it's one and a half years, uh, because it, we started the first summit where I participated was last year, April, so yeah. And how do you um, kind of mirror back your opinions to um, what are your channels to, to um, if you talk about the films in these Zoom groups? Um, where is your output? What do you? Well, usually the uh, youth council members uh, give us like questions. They ask us things, and what are our opinions? on the movie. Usually on the summits we speak about, well, first we watch the movie. It's usually a shorter movie and then we discuss about it. We have like, um, like room sessions. So yeah, that's how we talk. <laughs> but sometimes when, uh, like when we don't have a summit, when we have meetings, um, like regular meetings, then we just talk how to, like uh, about maybe, you know, making a podcast or uh, how to, like how to be, 
uh, known in social media and you know things like that. So, uh, for example, a big part of our uh, consultation group uh, input impact input was uh, last year and this year we were making a website for Euro which is uh, for young people of Europe where you can watch and find resources where to watch different European films that are made for young people. And uh, of that, there was a big input for us as in a way how the design of the website would look like or what color scheme we would use or something like that, you know? So it really was based on what we as the participants and the consultation group you'd cancel the young people think we would like and how to enlarge it to the bigger audiences around us. Uh, also, it is really interesting because people like different, uh, have, you know, they have different opinions and different ways. So basically, if you're more interested in editing, you can go and be in a group for editing. Or if you're interested in social media, like I am, you can be part of social media. So really, uh, all of us, we can choose like some sort of the path where we want to go. And uh, that is also like um, we made like little like smaller groups uh, and there are both uh, uh, youth council and consultation group members. So we always have meetings like in our groups. Okay. You will be able to talk to them individually, but if there are any questions right now, you can also ask them right now. Yeah. Yeah, I can, I think, yeah. Uh, hi, I'm Lennart from Sweden. I see there is no no participants from the Nordic countries. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I totally agree with you there. Okay, I refer it. There's no uh, rephrase. There's no one from Nordic, from the Denmark or Sweden or Norway or Finland. Yep, good, good, good. And the other question is, do you, the films you see, are they finished films or do you see films when they are in development or in a presentation? Sorry? Finished. <laughs> so basically we are watching usually the finished films and then we can also invite actors and then we uh, ask them different questions and then they answer. So it's basically like a Q&A session. Anyone else? <laughs> I just got the sign that we are going to move this to the other room and uh, to have it um, the more one-to-one -one thing because we are having the coffee break now. And um, afterwards, so I think everyone is, will be able to ask their questions individually. And um, afterwards, we are sticking with the young audience because we will have three members of the FBV jury here who will introduce their work to us. And, um, but now we have a 20 minutes coffee break with something to eat. So please mingle and enjoy. And thank you so much.